Hello, everybody. Um, you know, being a makeup artist, I absolutely love colors. I mean, I work with so many colors all the time. I'm not scared of using colors. And <clears throat> as a person, I know I wear black all the time, but I like to use a little splash of color. And um, <laughs> it's something I found really funny because I was doing a little uh, a take before I, I shot this. And every time I show you my hand, People start reading my hand. <laughs> I, I would say forget it <laughs> because, uh, yeah, I know I've got really dark lines and everything, but uh, but <laughs> don't try. Okay, so coming back to colors, yeah, I love it. And, um, and, you know, one thing I don't really, really love is that crazy nail art that people keep doing with stones and everything else on the nails. I mean, it, it looks... Uh, a lot of people are addicted to it. They love it because they grow their nails out. I bite my nails. Unfortunately, all my life I've bitten it. And of course, as a kid, I was my fingers were always in my mouth. And my mum used to uh, wrap my knuckles. But, um, you know, over the years, I've kind of weaned out. But you put a horror movie or a sad movie in front of me, I'm like, all my nails are gone. So somehow I managed to grow it out a little bit. And uh, talking about nail art, other than the stones and everything, I like to do something a little wacky. I know I am not the conventional kind of um, Malayali woman that you would normally come across, but um, but I like to do something a little wacky from time to time. And uh, nail marbling is something that you can do at home, which is stunning to do it. I want you to see what I did to my nails. That's called nail marbling. Look at that. That's my favorite. But it's quite cool, yeah. Again, I was talking about my my hands and my, you know, my the lines in my hands. But look at this. Fabulous, huh? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to do this. And of course, I've used all the colors possible just for you to see what it looks like on camera. But let's try something really different and new, okay? You can do this at home. Okay, so this is how you start. You know, a base coat always goes on first, a clear base coat. And then I painted my, all my nails white because I wanted the colors to pop out. And then I took tape and taped it around. So first along here, then around. Okay, so that the nail is white and you've got tape all around so your nail polish doesn't come all over. Otherwise, it's a crazy business to take that nail polish off so you tape out all your fingers and you've got white paint and then what i'm going to do is i'm going to um because it's difficult to show it on my own self so i've actually toothpicked a few false nails and i'm going to show you how it's done so you can do the same thing so i've painted all my false nails white as well so it's going to make it easy for you to see what is happening all right so now i'm going to take the camera away and show you exactly how it is done get yourself first a little i got myself a little shot glass um fill it with room temperature water and this is what you do so open up all the nail polish colors that you want to use it's all open because you know um too easy to use it easily you need some toothpicks yeah you need some earbuds and of course your nails which are taped up and with white paint on it and a, a glass full of water so what you do is you first take a drop let it spread out another drop in the center repeat you know and if it's not spreading really fast just pull this to the edge of your glass it will spread
pretty is that? Okay, I hope you can see what is happening. Then you take your toothpick, pull it out. And from outside, bring it in. And whichever nail of yours you want, see which pattern you like the most and place it on top of it and dunk it in. Take a Q-tip or a earbud and remove the rest of it. How easy is that? Remove the whole thing because you don't want, when the nail comes back up, you don't want it looking crazy. Look at that. Like it? Love it. I hope you can see it properly. Let's put that away. and do another one. So I'm just going to show you different, different colors that I've done, all right? So how easy was that? Look, I made a whole bunch of it for you. Easy to do at home. I know all of us keep looking at stuff to do at home. And this, I must tell you, is so beautiful. Don't you think? I think so. <laughs> okay, so go try it at home. And I use an apple to stick all this in because I needed it to stand up front and straight. There, it looks so stunning stunning try it enjoy it and we are bringing out a whole new range of ambika pillar lipstick and <laughs> lipsticks also but nail polishes which i'm sure you can work wonders with i'll see you soon bye